and hello everyone today I'm going to be showing if you have Galaxy S4 which has I showed the firmware uh, error occurred where you, where you were trying to restore or update the firmware and it's somewhere encounter a problem and if you see this message that I'm seeing right now hopefully we can help you with that this isn't a major issue it's just the firmware isn't installing right so to do, to do that, you're going to have to do s some file downloads which will be available in the description below. Just click on the website, download it, and our websites don't have any viruses, so don't worry. So press volume, power, volume down, power, and home button together. We'll pu put it into the DFU mode, which is called download mode in Android. And then press uh, volume up key connect to USB cable alright once you connect the USB cable you should download the drivers once it downloaded you're gonna have to need you're gonna have to download these two files one is called Odin which can be downloaded from anywhere but if you want to download it it's available in the description below and another file is called it's a root file so will show you how to do it once you the download mode you go into the Odin open up the Odin make sure you open as administration select PDA then you select the file and make sure when you open the Odin you should see the port on the left it says port 14 that's you, you should you should see it once you press start and if you see on your phone it should give you some movement you see the blue bar is going if that goes successfully then you know it's gonna come back it will restore restart your phone there and then you once it's restarted it will take some time so you see updating the binary files so let me recap this once you open the Odin, you should select the PDA file. But before you select the PDA file on the left, you should see the port number. Once you, s once you s press start, it says recovery and the green bar is completed. Wait, don't close the Odin. You should see the pass message. When it says recovery, there you should see the pass message. Then you close the Odin. So don't close it yet. I mean, it's not gonna happen anything if you just close it but we want to know that everything went successfully and to know that we just leave the Odin open and booyah it's passed see the green bar now it's restarting the phone again I have custom roams so this is how I see it. If you have different ROM, you'll see different ways. And if somebody want to know how to install custom ROMs, yes, we'll make a video of that too. And this is a ROM from uh, Galaxy Nexus 5. I mean, sorry, LG Nexus 5. We're gonna wait a few minutes. It depends. And booyah, it's back to work. You can set up as a new phone. Um, one more tip if somebody got to be stuck on the starting logo, uh, you can go into Fast, fast Boot Manager, go and clear, wipe the cache partition, or do the factory reset sometimes that also resolve the issues in my case it started so I don't have to go to that step but if somebody is stuck on that step you can do so
all right guys my phone is back to work alive and without any issue no problem don't panic that message it's it's just because the firmware isn't installing right or it got stuck somewhere in half a way maybe because you disconnect the cable or somewhere the system stuck the process stuck so not to worry if you have any questions you can write a comment below again download file is available at the website description below thank you for watching my videos thanks